Before Texas A&M made the move to a 3-4 defense in 2010, big Tony Gerardetti was just another interior lineman with size. After the move, Gerardetti became a force to be reckoned with. The 3-4 defense is kind of getting popular in the NFL, so the switch a couple of years ago to, ago to the 3-4 has really helped me out and uh, got people looking to see how versatile I am. You know, I played in the 4-2-5, I played in the 3-4, I played every position from zero to five, so I think that prepared me a lot. Jared Eddy's versatility helped the Aggies become one of the top defenses in the Big 12. Against the run, they were second in the league and 12th in the country. And against the pass, the Aggies led the nation in sacks. The six foot four inch, 303 pound Jared Eddy had to be more than just versatile. And when you go up against an offensive lineman that's undoubtedly 300 pounds or more, how do you get around or move somebody like that? Uh, you know, since Pee Wee football, the coaches have always said, you know, low man wins. So it's, it's all about leverage and, and knowing how to position yourself on, on, on different types of blocks. Well, okay, that's said. How's it done? <laughs> well, you know, you, low man wins, so you got to be low. So you got to work on, you always got to work on getting your pad level down and coming off the ball, being explosive out of your hips. If you get down too low, it can just push you down, right? So how do you, how do you combine getting low leverage with being able to be strong and up enough to be able to knock him off. It's, 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 a, it's, a, it's a median, it's a, it's a fine median right in between, so you just got to know, and that's where practice comes in, hitting the sleds, you know, get offs out of the shoots, those kind of things. Physics class involved in all that? No, yeah. if, you, if you're thinking that much, then you're not a good football player. <laughs> Jared Eddy was solid during one-on-one -on -one drills at the Senior Bowl, but did not earn an invitation to the Combine, which has left him thinking he still has much to prove to the NFL.